Hello. So there are a couple things you can do when you get your new glasses. Although both our labs check to make sure that the glasses are straight and even after they complete their processing and customization, you might find that your glasses uh, have are a little bit crooked. So just to be sure, lay your glasses on the table, on a flat surface, and make sure they're even. So there's a tiny little wobble to this one, for example. This left temple is maybe about a quarter of an inch off the table. I place it the other way and I take a look this way you can either place a ruler or some sort of a, some sort of a guide to help you see um, but generally just cast your eye everywhere and make sure everything looks even you want the temples to have a nice shape like that as opposed to Well, this is not actually so bad, but sometimes they they might come out like that. So that's, and if your glasses are like that, especially after you wear them, that's definitely an indication that your glasses are too small and you're basically stretching them to fit your face. In which case it could change the angle of, of the frames. When you do that, you see how they flatten and the lenses could then start to bother you. So these are things to look at. So what do you do when you get the glasses and they look very wide? You can very, very gently, but firmly, take a hold there and with the pillow of your thumb, just gently push in here and help it straighten out. And do small increments on both sides and check how it looks. The other thing you want to look at, I have a little dummy here. Um, when you put the glasses on, how does it fit around your ears? So this is really important because as you can see, there's a little bend right here and it's not actually fitting behind the ears of this person. The glasses would, the lens would have to be here for that to happen. And as you can see, that will fall off the person's face. So a lot of the times the frame temples come out straight and they might work fine for many people. But sometimes you might find that you might need to make a few corrections to make it fit better. One of the problems of it falling is because it's not fitting around the ears comfortably, especially in a frame like this. It's all plastic. So what do we do? We try and curl this temple end around the ears so that it can fit comfortably around there. And what we'll do is We just, we can just try and bend it a little bit. It's not that easy. Okay. And if you find that it's too hard, you can use a little hot water, boiling water, boil the water, and then just dip, dip the ends of the temples in hot water for about 30 seconds and then bend it. Try and do small increments. I always like to do small increments because this is a hard material and I want to make sure you find the right spot. So as you can see, it's a tad better. It's never actually going to fit this dummy because this dummy is a, a small, a really, really small um, youth size. But as you can see, what we want to do is get this kind of a look. A little bit more. The more you end up looping the ends 
behind the ear. See how it's looping more? The more you do that, the more it's holding. That's that's basically it, okay? So that's what we want to do. We want to have it hold a little bit better. You can, you know, depending on your comfort level and how small your face is, or even just this measurement from the back of your ears to the nose, because that's actually where we're concerned, right? It's That's what we're looking for when we look at the measurement of the temple. We're looking to see how that frame is going to fit at, in this space right here. That's what we're looking for. And if you have a large measurement in that space, you can always measure it. But if you have a large measurement in that space, then you need something that has a very long temple. If you have a smaller head or a smaller measurement, it's also the positioning of the ear, then uh, you need something that has a smaller measurement or something medium that you can then fit like this. So that's really very important. I hope this helps you in understanding how the temple works.